and welcome to a brand new episode of Taxi Life. Hope you guys have enjoyed the first two episodes. We are now about to buy a brand new vehicle. Uh, this vehicle is probably the best option in terms of investment. I have noticed there's a few jobs which involve um, trunk space. So transporting lots of luggage and this will be the perfect vehicle. And I've got the right amount of money, but... I'm stupid, so we're going to buy the vintage vehicle, because why not? This is a high-standard vintage car for €5,000. The stats aren't great, apart from braking power for some reason. It drinks fuel. It's got a small tank. This is probably the worst investment I'm probably going to make in the game. Ooh. Oh. So this is how we run a company. By having multiple vehicles. I guess that doesn't make sense. Ah. So. Uh, yeah. My, my car does need a bit of work. <laughs> it's not looking great. Uh, if we activate the vintage car. In use. Lovely. And then can the. I guess could, can we hire someone? Can we get a driver? Oh my god. Okay. Things have just got interesting. So. Here you can see the drivers you can hire. Those with black backgrounds and the drivers you've hired. Okay. So we haven't hired anyone yet. So one of the drivers, hire him or her. You can see each has different details. Each has pros and cons. And they can change during the game. New drivers will be available every three hours. Okay. So a little bit lazy. Don't like that. Can be sick often. Don't like that. Miss Hill, I think you have the job. I've hired you. It's done. Now go back to the car section and assign the driver to the car. Um, I wish the car was in slightly better shape, but there we go. You can now decide which driver you want to assign to each vehicle. So, yeah, so we really need to try and get more money to buy more vehicles. One million percent. One million percent. We have to, we have to do that. Right, we need to head back out and we need to um, do, do, do the business. Get some jobs in, get the money in, properly grind... Some, uh, some money. Is it dark? Well, it's getting dark. Right, where is our first client? Also, it's a beautiful vintage vehicle. So we need to make sure we look after it. Um, One million percent. Maybe turn the car on first. Oh, how does it sound? I'm guessing there's a bit of customization to it, but again, we have no money right now, so we have to be super, super careful. So yeah, we've got a brand new vehicle, and we've started a company already. What a great start to this video. Whoa, turning is um, interesting. Okay. I really don't want to smash this up. Huh. I'm going to try. <laughs> All right, let's arrive. Let's take our first passenger. Hope you like the car. I mean, look, look at it. This is fine Hi. equipment. This is a fine automobile. It's quite a long journey, actually. Just in the speed. One sec. Where is the speed? Oh, there it is. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Old dials. Fantastic. Oh, we're taking a right here. Remember, this does drink fuel for fun. So, let's keep an eye on that. Why don't I decide to do cockpit cam on this journey? Oh, <laughs> it's a big one. It's a big vehicle. It's scary. Let's go chase cam for a little bit. Can I zoom out a little bit? That, that works. I'll try not break the speed limit. Again, we want as much money as possible here. I want the ultimate tip. Please. Pretty please with a cherry on top. Are we going right here or straight? Are we going straight? Who cares about road markings? Um, are we okay to go? Let's go right here. I changed the destination. Oh. Drive me there, please. Um, has the sat nav updated? Okay, check the new destination. Sure. That's never happened before. It's realistic, though. Sometimes a meeting's changed or a meeting's cancelled. You want to go somewhere else? I like that. That's cool. As long as the GPS updates for me. Uh, well. Jesus. Sorry, I was so focused on my conversation. <laughs> I completely missed the red light. Whew. 
I slammed the handbrake on it. I'm not sure if you guys spotted that. To try and slow me down. Holy. That could have gone wrong. That could have gone very wrong. Oh. Right, 70 miles an hour. Oh, not 70 miles an hour. 70 kilometers an hour. Must admit, going that speed in this car does terrify me a little bit. Just a tiny bit. I don't think that was a red light, was it? Oh, was it a red light? Ah, oh, what is wrong with me in red lights today? I think I went straight for a red light. No! I guess we'll get that confirmed at the end. Oh, gee. How annoying is that? Sorry. <laughs> I almost did it twice. I did it once. Great. Fantastic. Fan bleeding testing. My lights on. I think they are. That's right. She should still give us a tip, as long as we don't make any other sort of big mistakes. I'm guessing it's 70 down here, right? Should I stick to 50 just in case? I'm pretty sure it's 70. I'm going right here anyway. The way they just come out. Absolute lunatics. Is this our first time driving at night as well? I think it might be. Away from crossover. Do not run them over again, please. That was that was a violent, violent episode. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I killed someone in the last episode. But we're ignoring it, it's fine. It's completely fine. I thought he was gonna try and cross then. Uh yeah. A lot of people in the comments are like, I'm really terrified that you actually drive. Um <laughs> Uh, which is fair. Yeah, that's fair. <laughs> Honestly, I've... Touch wood. I said it in the comments. I've never had... Um, I'm just going to throw it here. Uh, I've had no issues yet. <laughs> there's, there's always time. I have one speeding ticket. I got a little bit excited um, when I <laughs> went to see Top Gun Maverick. I went up the slip road onto like a... I think it's an A road or an M road. A little bit too quick. And got a ticket, got three points instantly. Can do like a speed awareness course or anything, but that was it. That's that's. Oh, I got a bit excited. Okay, just seen Top Gun Maverick, which is an incredible film. I thought I was Maverick. Got a little bit carried away. I got no idea what this person's doing. What are you doing, fool? We're almost there. What are you trying? Are you trying to get an insurance claim on me or something? Honestly, what are you doing? Okay, this is erratic breaking. It's incredible how realistic this game is as well. Like the AI actually does act like an idiot, which is actually incredibly realistic. It really is. Oh, this is quite a tight little spot. Wish me luck. You're not taking my spot? No, I don't think so. That is very tight. Oh, oh I made it. Such a pleasure riding with you. Oh, good. See? Such a pleasure. Such a pleasure, despite the fact I went through a red light. Small collision. I think I slightly might have hint, hint that that bullard, that bullard thingy. Yep. Anyway, we're getting quite a decent amount of money for this. I guess maybe because the vehicle is like a luxury vehicle. 621 euros. Yes, I would love to accept that, please. Thank you very much. Um, I need to go. Can you go past? Oh, wow. They saw me indicate. And they didn't go. Nice. Oh, don't run over, Scott. I like how you can be... Before you got the um, the client on board, you can generally be a bit more relaxed. Within reason, of course. Yes, yeah, so I've gone from zero to already having 729. I think that might be uh, my other driver racking in the money using my other vehicle. The vehicle was not in the best shape. Um, someone T-boned me again. I did, just did a couple of jobs outside of a video. I got T-boned and it was just 
running a bit low on maintenance. Guessing like the brakes and stuff are a bit gone. Where are we going? Is that graffiti? It's definitely graffiti. Can I claim it? No, I can't. Man, I look so smart in here. I'm living. Right, should we try an entire... We're going to try this entire run. Um, just in the cockpit. Wish me luck. I guarantee it won't be a perfect, but... I'll give it a go. <laughs> I'll give it a go. Right, cockpit, here we come. Unless I can't see the traffic lights. That's my only issue. If I can't see the traffic lights, I'll go to chase cam. I think oh. that's fair. Right, let's go. It's quite hard to see the speed on this thing, but I won't. Sort of in the middle of 20 and 30. Uh, 20 and 40, of course. I get, you, you guys know that. Just staying the obvious, but... I'm just like confirming it for myself. Patience seems pretty good. This is a pretty tight turn. Jeez, crossing. Field of view is not so good in this car. But this is actually quite a long journey. Trust me to go. Oh yeah, just do um, pop cockpit the whole time. It's a great idea. Uh, why do I do this to myself? Are you going across now as well? The traffic's in the intersection coming up. I'm not working correctly. Noted. What's all next to me? Oh, hello. You good? <laughs> Patience went down a little bit there. Might be going a bit too quick. Doo -doo -doo. What an incredible vehicle. An incredible piece of engineering. Being driven by me. Proper like You pretty get married in this thing. Also, one thing I don't want to do is almost finish the journey and then get like a penalty or something, or accidentally hit someone and it just cancels the whole fair that would be um that would not be good that would not be good i can't go right here which is fine if you know i'm coming we're good um can i just i can't really see much here i think only i have a feeling only my side lights are on highlights Are they on now? I tried to turn them on. Whether they turned on or not, I don't know. You may have slightly hit the curb. <laughs> Whoops. It's the police. Be careful, Scott. Be careful. Anyone crossing? My field of view inside is not. It's not not great. <laughs> it's not great. It's kind of scary. Are you crossing? Put the handbrake on just to make sure. That's where the patient's dropped there. Like, I got to stop for people crossing. I'm sorry. I'm going. What is it? Why is why is it so busy? What time is it? Nine fifteen. Okay, I thought it was a bit later than that. People do have social life, Scott. People do go out at night. Fair. To be honest, I've got absolutely no idea what the speed limit is down here. I'm guessing it's 50, but just playing it safe. 
A lot of people have been asking, do I recommend the game? Um, I just I keep saying the price is just a bit too high for me. Uh, I do like it. Um, there's definitely fun aspects of the game that I'm enjoying. But I just wish maybe it was a little bit slightly less money. Just a tiny bit. Where the hell was the road markings? Just, just, just guess, I guess. There you go. Just making sure. I probably could have got through that, but it's not worth dropping the patience level for, to save a couple of seconds. Where are we parked, by the way? It goes not too bad. The screen! Go, go, go! It's actually quite pretty at night, isn't it? There must be semi down here, surely. Normally three lanes, like you're, you're golden. Well, we're about to find out, because um, there's a speed camera right here. Yeah, we good. But, damn, this car looks good at night. Look at it. Beautiful. Switch lanes, come in the wrong lane. Sorry, sorry, sorry again. I was looking, by the way. I did see no one was behind me. What the? I swear if that was my car, I would have flipped. I would have flipped. I would have got out. I'm not sure that's even allowed. Wait, what are you doing? Okay, that's fair enough. Mate, I've got priority here. What are, you, what are you doing? Was I in the wrong there? Let me know in the comments. I don't know if laws are different elsewhere, but I had priority. He was crossing into my lane. So he should not be doing that. At least in the UK. Oh, I love it. I love when it happens. Oh. When you get to a traffic light, it just switches to green. Oh. Actually, saying that, in my car, I've got currently, I quite like being. <gasps> I quite like being first at the traffic lights when they. So, obviously, it's, it's red, amber, green. Woohoo! It's got quite good acceleration, so I quite, I quite enjoy myself. Which I think's fair. Oh, look at that, it changed again. Oh, beautiful. Beautiful. This been, has this been our longest job? definitely has how's the fuel so it's gone down a quarter if i'm reading that correctly which is like oh, it's not too bad it's all right fuel does cost quite a bit though Just gonna switch lanes here try not hit a parked car scott <gasps> what happened there that's terrifying just like shaking Getting very, very close to the destination now. No more screw ups. 70. Go, 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 go. Go on, lads. The vehicles actually are quite good in this game in terms of like performance. They ain't sluggish. I mean, I've never seen a vintage car in my entire life move that quick. Never in my entire life have I ever seen that. That was utter madness. Absolute madness. Right, we have almost reached the destination. I think that went fairly well. Um, you can see we spent most of the time in cockpit cam in a brand new vehicle. Oof, again. If that was me. I would lose the plot. Try and park in this nicely. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Yay, we did it! Pleasure riding with you. We got a full cabin as well. You can get like a, a people carrier, which 
so I have to carry multiple people. There's certain jobs that even at the moment I just can't do because I don't have enough trunk space. That's a decent amount of money, though. That's a good old tip. Wowzers. Apparently, I've got no red marks, which I'm not... So was I just driving too slow? Potentially. Yeah, maybe that was the issue. I was just driving too slow at certain moments. All right. Interesting indeed. Right, so... You'll see some of the people that are hollowed out. So this guy wants a big trunk. I don't have a big trunk. Um, that's definitely going to be probably my next purchase. So we're trying to get towards 5,000 for that to get another vehicle. Um, how's management going? Are you doing? One sec. Why is the vehicle? What? I thought I selected the... What? Oh, my God. I thought I did this. I didn't do it. Okay, so we haven't actually assigned her to a job yet. Okay, so you can, so you can select the district. Okay. Um, you can do that district. Lovely. Um, and then we've got to select our time. That feels a bit mean. Let's just do a nice, a nice time. Eight hour shift between nine and five. Perfect. Done. Some what's that? It can happen that the driver will bring in losses. Okay, I've got to keep an eye on this then. If she's losing me money, she's gone. <laughs> she's out. No way, Jose. So we're gonna look at the profits as well. We've got two cars. Of course, I want to try and get a third car as well at some point. So uh, yeah, uh, let's do another job. There's one just here, so let's, let's do that one. I'm hoping I can get out of here. We can now go back to Chase Cam because it's fun seeing the car in its glory. There we go. Got our handbrake on, as I always seem to do. Right, let's get going. I'm fully aware I'm probably breaking laws here, but no one's in my cabin. It's just me. I can play my music nice and loud. One thing I would like to see is more customers asking for stuff, like opening the window, opening a certain window, turn the aircon on, turn the radio on. Haven't had that often. More conversations. A lot of the fares are just silent, which I must admit I prefer in reality, but in terms of the game, it makes it just a little bit more exciting. Also, you get distracted as well. It's quite, a, it's quite easy to get distracted by someone asking for something. And then this goes horribly wrong, which is, um, yeah. Right, our next client. Beep. So I'm parking the box, Scott. Get in. Hope you're having a fabulous evening. Hey there. Ignore the vehicle rolling. Do, 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 do. It shouldn't be a, too long. Yes, I guess you have. And eventually, you have multiple vehicles. You have them assigned to every district. And then you're making buck. You're making some serious money. I mean, that's the goal, isn't it? That is the, that is the dream. Um, hopefully, um, we can buy another vehicle in the next video. That's going to be the goal, I think. To keep the purchasing vehicles, keep employing people. Obviously, if they don't make us money... Uh, they're instantly, instantly gone. Get out. <laughs> if you're not making me money, what's the point? I'm sorry, that sounds brutal, but it's true. I give her a nice shift as well. Nice nine to five. No, like, weird hours. <laughs> Put the handbrake on there. Apparently the brakes have been quite good in this vehicle. I'd argue it's actually its weak point, but... Who am I to say that? Who am I to say that? Oh, there it is. Right, we're going right here. We should be okay in this lane. Actually, no, I do need to get in that lane. Ooh, sorry. Thank you. I don't run this person over. No, I was in the right lane. Damn it. Park it up. That was a pretty um, easy fare. Whoop. See, I can drive. I knew it. <laughs> I knew it. Here read the stats there. Reach level five. I'm hoping that means we have. So, yeah, I guess we wait till nine and then she should be out. It'd be quite cool if we can see her and see my vehicle. And it like, oh, that'd be quite cool. I don't know if that's even a possibility. 
Who knows? But we do have a skill point to spend. Now we can work on the company stuff. So fixed costs are cheaper for company cars. Your company saves money because of it. All right. Should we go for that? Sure. I'm all about the company. Drivers being a uh, sorry. Drivers bring in more money for completing tasks. Your company makes more profit. That's a good one as well. So I might go for that. I might, what I might do, if I'm allowed to, is reset my skill points. There we go. All about the company and improving the company. And let's go for money saver. Perfect. That spot on. Spot on. Right, who should go for next? Who is available? I'm coming to get you. So ordered uh, me via some Uber app, maybe? I don't know. Vehicle looks in very good, Nick. It's still very, very clean. The fuel is a little bit low. But I can still go for many, many more jobs before I could be concerned about that. I'm a bit upset I went through that red light. Went through one red light. That's probably the... Yeah, I haven't really made many other mistakes. What the? What was that? I swear you must have gone for a red light. Must have. I guess we know how easy it is to do. <laughs> true, true, true. Yep, yeah, that's fair. Yeah, and I think we definitely could do like a an episode uh, where we are like just driving like a lunatic, GTA style. Um, I might even do like a rage episode. Where we just we just rage at everybody. Uh, yeah, because some potentially like cool ideas we can do with this video with this series. Um, obviously, expect videos uh, like this where we just kicking back. Pretty sure reversed into that. Oh, well. Get in. Hey there. Guarantee our patience goes instantly, but I hope not. Hello. I've got a full car. One sec, is that? Oh, hello. Oh, lovely. So we're going down here. Oh, am I allowed to go down there? I don't think I am. It's a bit misleading though, because the sat nav is taking me down there. Or can I? Maybe I can actually. Maybe I can. I think I was just um, speeding. Oops. that red okay. not the best start but we move I think I might scrape my tyres as well my rims man we are looking swanky in here aren't we hello everybody good do I even have aircon in this vehicle Seventy. Yeah, for a vintage vehicle, it is incredibly fast. Oh, it's a race. Can you turn on the AC? Oh, here we go. Um, sure. Give me two seconds. I press on the wrong button. See, I'm panicking now. Look, AC. Turn it on. Thanks. No problem. Could have ignored her, but definitely panic there. <laughs> you made the passenger happy. Good work. Well. I mean, it's what I do. It's what I do. So we've definitely been... Um, we definitely have complained about our speed, which is fair. I keep speeding accidentally. Oops. But not too bad apart from that. She was a bit warm or cold. We turn the aircon on, and she's happy. What more could she ask for? Comfort is king. <laughs> it, it is. Oh, what happened behind me? I heard a crash. Definitely heard a crash. Was it caused by me? Potentially. Get going! Mate, what are you doing? Are you going left or what? Okay, good. Am I in the wrong lane here? I think I was. Very briefly. Hit the ramp. Ooh. 
I'm going to guess the speed's 50. So I'm, I'm more focused on my speed than the road, which is just... It's just stupid, isn't it? It's just... That's what caused the accident. Oh my god. Wow. 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 Speechless. She thinks she's yellow, and she thinks I can see her for miles. What is this steady stream? I'm going. What is this steady stream of people just coming out for? It's like they're doing it to anger me. <laughs> they're trying to slow me down. I guarantee it. What time is it now? One, is it? Is that it? Is it like real time or something? Is it real time? A minute must be... Is it 10 seconds or 20 seconds? Yeah, something like that. Yeah, they're quite long minutes. They're not like in-game minutes where they're, like, they're stupidly quick. What's this question mark on the map? Is it a graffiti? I don't know what it is. Weird. Uh, we've made it to the destination in one piece. Go me. Yay! Beep! Made it. Thanks. Have a nice day. I will have a beautiful day. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Um, small collision. Uh, oh, did I, is that when I hit the, um, the curb? Yeah, I guess so. Oops. <laughs> Oopsie doodles. I'm going to end the episode there. I need to try and earn some more money. And hopefully the next episode, we'll see our employee out in the car um, earning us some money. Can't wait for that. Yeah, buy a new vehicle. See our employee actually earn some money. That's the goal of the next episode. Thank you guys for watching. See you guys soon. And bye-bye.